G'day gents. Well, today I'm going to answer a question that many of you have asked of me, and that is, how do you break in a brand new brush? Well, the principle you'll be happy to know is the same as cleaning a brush. Now, last video we spoke about the three different types of brushes. We had the synthetic, the ball, and of course, the badger brush. Well, this principle can be used essentially for the ball and the badger, but of course, there's no reason why you couldn't use this with a synthetic brush, although the synthetic brush doesn't really require as much maintenance. The three things that you'll require, obviously, would be the brush, a little bowl where you can wash and or season the brush, and of course, some dishwashing liquid. The first thing you need to do is to place some warm water in a little bowl, take the brush, dab it in there, make sure you add the detergent, agitate it slightly, and leave it there for about 10 to 15 minutes. You then take out the brush, give it a good rinse, take your brush and then lather up as you normally would with your favorite soap or cream. And here comes the interesting bit, you leave it in the brush overnight. Now, some people I know don't agree with this method, but I found that it works perfectly, particularly for removing that rather funky smell from your bore brushes. Now, a bore brush will reward. Get away from this myth that bore brushes are just cheap and nasty. They are very, very good brushes, but they do require some seasoning, as I said previously. And that seasoning means that you'll have to probably shave with them about 10 to 15 times. And you can accelerate this process by using what I'm talking about today. When you come back the next day, wash it thoroughly, soak it in warm water for about two or three minutes. And then as soon as that's happened, give it a good wipe and you'll find that the smell, the odor, which is characteristic of uh, most ball brushes, will have gone. This also assists it in seasoning the brush. What do you do when you season a brush? Well, you get it to bloom, to, to actually start to fold out, or actually explode out. And this is really like creating split ends in a hair. I know it sounds kind of destructive, but that's what you need to do, particularly to bore brushes, to get them where you want them to be. In the next video, I'll show you and tell you exactly how you can go about cleaning your brush. Well, I hope this has been helpful for you. Catch us in the next video. Oh, and uh, like this video.